Do you really need a record label? Okay guys, today we're discussing something which is very very serious. Serious, serious, serious. So, do you really need a record label? <laughs> okay guys, I'll be voicing out the opinions um, and the experiences um, with record labels. So, the first one is that do you really need a record label? Depends on your what you want to achieve at that particular time. We won't lie about the record labels because record labels have done a lot for a music artist. Especially if you are a music artist uh, which is a bit unknown. Londole can be advantageous for you and for the record label also. And it can be disadvantageous for a record label for you. I don't know, maybe for you too. But let me explain what I mean. First of all, record labels. Let's take an example for E. I won't mention names for convenience sake. Let's say, for example, E National Record Label, Yeti House, a South Africa, which is well known. If you are an artist and no one knows you, and that particular record label decides to sign your tracks that's an obvious one you'll get a lot of following you'd get a crowd you'd get a supporters you'd get uh, you'd get a lot of things because there are loyal supporters is a record label this time because some record labels are trusted to deliver good sounds most people really check after who delivers the sound but we trust certain label so each and every track that drops under a certain label will surely be dope so that's why record labels have to be strict on a type of sound yeah because imagine hearing a boom track with deep house record label after that you'll be like yo I Yes, yes, I'm dropping the label, label and all that stuff. And secondly, advantages for a label. Because labels, the first thing for a label, what we should know as artists, record label is a business, guys. A record label is a business before it's anything else. It's someone's business or it's other people's business, but it is a business at the end. And I know how he abound people, the artists or a business owners, they always give you the line, but we do this because we love this. Music at the end of the day is our main what what wara 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 don't lay a eco on my clash of money especially good record labels record labels are in it for the cash most of the times yes they may love the music they may started the record label because of lovely music but once it generates cash and it becomes a whole big brand it's about the money most of the times that's why you'd find out most record labels don't make it because the money is not coming in and that's just it the money is not coming in a record label may drop hard fire dope tunes and still fail because the money is just not coming in guys and that's it just the money is not coming in so they always have to make ways of getting cash into the business so that's why most of the artists vulnerable to exploitations from a record labels because of the money simple it's just because of the money so uh, i don't think i'll get into detailed kulo and record labels nemali and i have my own experiences about that which maybe i'll share one day but for now it's not the video so guys just let me know when at the type of experiences you've had with the record labels was it good for you did it end well for you or is it working for you now because it does even happen even now that some of you guys want to release under certain labels you just you keep sending demos and they are rejecting you and that's fine just let let, let me just let us know about your experiences with the record labels record labels have done a lot for each and every one of us and we cannot ignore that we cannot ignore that even myself record labels have done a lot for myself and one other thing a lot of people don't realize is that people think it's just easy for record labels if it was easy, just open up your record label now and see how much cash you're gonna charge it's not easy guys it's not easy it's not easy that's why most record labels don't make it but do you need a record label as an artist for me especially times have changed now maybe back in the day to make it very big you need the record label but even now the record label can help you become a bigger artist just have just 
just like I've mentioned at the beginning of your video. Imagine if you'd be signed like sign with Ambitious Records, for example, which is a record well known. So definitely the following will you'll you gain the following. And another thing was e distribution. Most of us want to sell our tracks online, for example. We want to drop e tracks, go track source, Google Play, what what and how you do that back in the day is that you'd have e middleman which is a record label which will take your music and distribute it all over the world so that people can buy. But the thing is nowadays you can actually do that independently by yourself even now if you wanted to if you wanted a record label just to release your music then when well, you don't need a record label <laughs> so you're just like you didn't know that or maybe you're fooling yourself you don't need a record label if that's your main aim for example for me we not this uh it's only 20 months this year i just want to push it tracks as i'm so you barely find me under a record labels dropping a lot of stuff under record labels i think i might drop one or maybe two record labels Samachita Anga like friends just to, to support a label yeah so I might drop there but for me personally I don't feel like I have to go through under the record labels to get my music distributed because you can do that independently via a tuning call CDPAP DistroKid nowadays those are distributors and there are a lot of them no Reverb Nation I think I think no Reverb Nation are ah, distributors also so just sign up there you pay the fee and then you get your tracks to our track source or Google Play, Amazon, Apple iStore, I'm an Apple Store, and other music platforms whereby people can buy your tracks. So you gotta make sure you know why you need a record label. You can distribute your music without the record label. So guys, I think I'm gonna end it there for now, and I'm very sure that we'll have to discuss something about record labels in the near future. So for now, just let me know if you've dropped tracks under any record label, and are you happy with it? Did it work out really fine for you? And how did it go? And what do you think you should do in the near future? Oh, cool. Let me bounce. Peace.